Bond after Bond A, and welcome to another class. Today we're just going to do three poses. The bridge, the fish, and the plow. Let's get started. So we're just going to come straight down onto the floor. Bridging is a beautiful movement to lengthen and segment the spine. And you also get a very gentle stretch through the thighs. Then on your back, chin slightly bend down. Both of these bent. Knees and feet hip distance apart. It's up to you how close you have the heels to the bottom. Anywhere from an inch to four inches to the spine, you're looking for the feeling that the feet are very firm into the floor. When you're ready, push down in the feet, the pelvis will lift and send some weight into the shoulders. You can actually walk the arms under if you want to. I like to hold the bridge, but if you don't, you can exhale and come down a vertebrae at a time.
who come back up to sit in. On the final close this morning is um, how I understand the, the plan. So. And let on my mat, knees bent, knees and feet, hip distance apart. Arms just come to play by the side of the body. At first, you might want to use a little bit of momentum, but do get out of that if you can. When you're ready, take your feet off the floor, make sure the feet are nice and relaxed. Then, in one movement, knees in and legs over. At first, you might want to just stay here. Keep the legs and feet relaxed. Relax into the back of the body as well. find that the rib cage in the back begin to relax and you can start to drop the feet down to the floor. Whether you took the toes under or the front of the foot is resting on the mat. That's up to you. Two different stretches. Thank you.